So this is a blog post I'm comparing editing to making a sandwich. <laughs> Hi, my name is Andrew Aldridge and today for this blog post I wanted to explain my process of how I edit. But instead of doing a screen capture and having things go boop 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 boop, I'm going to make a sandwich and kind of use that as a uh, parallel, as a comparison. So we're just, we're just going to try and make it make sense. So first off what we do, we have our ingredients which is our footage. So that's this right here, this whole bag. So I have my bread, chips, got some mustard, ham, a little bit of tarragon, and a little bit of pickles, some uh, grillé, and butter. Okay, it's kind of happening right now. If we can think this is our footage, music, and all that sort of stuff, what's already happened, and an assistant editor might have done this, is they put them into different bins, into different things. So we have our ham, which is our kind of our main action of the piece, too. We have a little bit of cheese that we're going to put on here, and this is like, um, you know, it's kind of it's kind of a little bit of comedy. It's kind of not cheesy. It's well, it's cheese, but it's cheesy. Of course, your bread, your intro and your outro, and then we have this this little stuff right here all these ingredients, which is going to kind of be our little bit of, uh, a little bit of drama, or a little bit of uh, music, stock music. So here's how I add it. And the chips, people like chips. So first thing we're gonna do, let's open up this sandwich. Yeah, let's just dump it out right here. I like to go through, you know, the footage, you know, and see what's going on here, pick out some good pieces. Yeah, these two pieces look good. Let's put that on the plate right here. Yeah, that's a good start. That's a good start right there. Next, let's pull out this ham right here. And this right here is like some good footage. And we're just going to go through and take a look at some of these pieces. Uh, as you can see, like, you know, let me sample this. Oh, yeah, that's good. We're just going to try and find some good pieces of ham to put in here. And this is kind of how I like to edit, too. I like to kind of jump right in, dive right in, not worry about all the, re all the ingredients all at once, but just let's take some, like this right here is a good piece. This is a good piece. And we'll fold it up, make a little fold, and we'll put this on our sandwich like that. Okay? It's important that, like I said, I like to just, just go ahead and make like what's called a rough cut right away, you know? So just start to get a sense of what the sandwich or our, our sequence, this is, the plate's our sequence. Get a sense of what it's looking like. All right, three pieces is good. Let's add four. Let's add four. All right. Boom, boom. Okay. And you can see I kind of tore a few pieces off right here, like this piece right here. You can kind of tear it, put it on. That's called cutting. That's called editing right there. All right, so we're going to put our ham back in our bin and take our bread. Editing can be kind of messy too, you know, it's like things can kind of go different places. But that's okay because it's, it's just what's, you're just concerned about the final product. All right, next let's open up this Gruyere because we want to put some lovely cheese on there. All right. All right, this is looking good. Let's help it. Which knife is better? This one. This one? This one good? This one good? All right, let's just kind of, and this is, this is like editing right here. We're just cutting off some footage. Oh, yeah, it's nice and soft, too. That's a big old chunk. All right, cut that. Well, that's kind of a not-so-good cut, so we might not use that. All right, yeah, there we go, yeah. Okay, there we go. Great. That's a nice chunk of cheese right there. And, you know, this right here, boom, you got yourself a sandwich. This would probably be fine if you threw it out there, but, you know, we're going to, we're going to amp this up, too. I'm going to take all this stuff off, put that there. I'll eat that bread later. So what I like to do is sometimes send this, this intro and outro into After Effects or Photoshop and really kind of add a little bit of a uh, little jazz it up a little bit, make it a little bit better. So I'm going to send it to After Effects Woo! over there. And then you pull it out and boom. It's like it's been rendered, you know? It's like it's got a little bit of toast now. So now that's really Oh, this is going to be so much better because now we have toasted bread, special effects put on there, a little bit of color correction, you know, you know the game, you know the game. All right, let's reassemble this right here. Okay, that's looking good, and it's always good to sample it a little bit. Oh, yeah, that's good. Mm-hmm, that's good. Now, we'll put this aside for now. I'll just take that. Throw it there. There, we got a big bowl, no whisk. Sometimes you don't always have the right tools as an editor, but... I'm going to use this right here. These are little uh, cornichorns, 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 <laughs> cornichon pickles. And so we're going to make a little bit of like a little bit of dressing to put on this sandwich. And I'm comparing these 
Cornichon, Cornichon? <laughs> Cornish John Pickles to like stock music. You know, I just pulled this off the shelf. You know, this is, this is our music right here. And basically, this is gonna help this whole piece, this whole sandwich sing. So let's open this up. All right. All right, so I'm just gonna take this and it's gonna do like a little bit of a third of a cup, you know? And let's do this, you know? When you get the music into, when you get the music into, uh, uh, you know, Premiere, whatever sort of editing program you're gonna do it, then you have to do some cutting. So let's just chop this up right here. Oh yeah, that's about a third of a cup. You know, you don't always measure things when, while you're editing or cooking, you know, it's, 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 this is not, this is not precise. This isn't baking. You just really, you just really wanna chop it up. You know, just really get it going. Chop it. All right. Chop it. That's about a third of a cup, I'd say. Maybe less, but that's okay. Put it in the big bowl. Really just, really slabby do it in there. We wanna do a quarter cup of some Dijon mustard. And this is like our little bit of, uh, you know, sound effects. And a little bit of sound effects in here, right? And then you go, a little bit of sound effects. A little bit of sound effects right there, boom. You know, that's, that's probably good. I don't wanna overdo it with the Dijon. You don't wanna overdo it with the sound effects and just go ba 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 all the time. And then we have a little bit of tarragon. And this is just like, Oh, you smell it. Yeah, that's just like those like nice little, you know, swelling moments, little cymbal crashes or, you know, just those little, you know, that little kind of, yeah, you just want to add a little bit in there, sprinkle it in. You know it's there, you know, little sound effects. Just, uh, yeah, just make it real nice. Just really chop it up. I probably should have taken it off the stems. The stems are going in. Actually, I'll take off these stems. Take off the stem. Nobody likes the stems. Nobody likes the stemmy thing. It's okay, I guess if we have a few, throw that in there. Boom. And then we wanna add a little bit of butter. And it says room temperature, but you know, we're gonna cheat a little bit. I'm just gonna cut, cut that like that. Oh yeah, this is, I love editing. This is so much fun. I'm just gonna, it said room temperature. I'll throw it in here. Throw it in here for 30 seconds. Get a little bit. You know, this is like sending it into audition. That's Adobe Audition. You know, I'm doing a little bit of uh, noise cancellation and deverberation. Oh yeah, that's good. That's already, that's weights. Oh, shoot. Well, you just don't want to go overboard with that sort of stuff. You know, let's mix it up. There you go. Pour it in there. Oh. Nobody said editing was pretty. Nobody said editing was pretty. I probably shouldn't have done it for that long. You really just want to mix it all up. All right, mix it up. Yeah, that's good. Great, this is our sound mix right here. This is looking good, you know what? And so we're just gonna take our sound mix. Let's just put, I don't wanna overdo it. Just put a little bit right there in our timeline. A little bit right there in our timeline. Right there, right there in our timeline. Yeah, that's good. Oh yeah. Two more things we have to add. This is like a color correction right here. And I know it's not, don't take it. I'm not changing the color of it, but this is just like adding that little bit of fine seal at the end where it just enhances those sort of, enhances the picture a little bit. So I'm gonna add a little bit of pepper. A little bit of pepper. Pep, 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 pep. Okay, not much. And a little bit of salt. You don't wanna go heavy with the salt. You don't wanna go heavy with like color correction and saturation, make it look like it's like something out of, I don't know, something, some, something, uh, Armageddon. I, I, I don't know. So here it comes. This is a big flippy flop right here. Boop, smoosh that down. And let's just give it us a cut in half. Oh yeah, boom, boom, look at that. That looks delicious. And then of course, like this right here, 18 paper towels. And you know, everybody likes a little bit of chips at the end. This right here is like uh, your audience and critics. They can be a little bit salty at times, but you know what? Tastes good with a sandwich, okay? So voila, this is a, uh, a ham and cheese sandwich with a little bit of stuff on it. And this is just like a final edited piece that I'm gonna put up on YouTube. You know, it's gonna taste good. I think it's gonna taste good. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's pretty good. Sometimes you don't know what you have until you've taken a bite of it. And all of a sudden, hey, that's not looking so bad. That actually tastes pretty good. That's how, we, that's how I edit. It's a little bit messy. It can be a little bit funny at times, but in the end, it tastes pretty good. And uh, you just want to make sure that uh, you follow the script in some cases. Sometimes you go off script, you edit with your gut, however you edit. It, this, is, this is how I do it if I were making a sandwich. 
right